the number one team by the CHL. Here we go. We're underway at TD Station. Puck at center. That's turned back by Miller. Down low. Calder. Back up to Amyot. Cross ice. Here comes Tivy. The shot into the midsection of Fleming. And a vacuum cleaner. That draw is won back by Gauguin. The shot kicked up by injury. Now back in center ice, and it's McLean over. And now Pedal with a burst. Here comes Pedal's shot, and its stop is made from Fleming, who right now is perfect with rebound. No one could get a stick on it. Kept in at the line by Dubé. And then his pass attempt, it hits a stick, and then here comes St. Ange walking in. St. Ange on the break. Oh, the save by Gravel. Beverage. His pass off the skate of Reynolds. It's not going to be icing. And that forces Daniel back into his own zone. Nice job by Reynolds. Strips the puck. Loose in front. Yard bats it out of the air. And Fleming makes the save. Off. Man pushes it up the boards. Groove flips it in the air to center. Play is broken up. Bounces around. And then back in over the line. Lollier. Shot into the midsection of Gravel. And he does it. He slides it ahead to Groove. Backhands to Moran. He'll... Put the brakes on, finds the late man. That's Gru, the save is made. Rebound, scores! Well, I mean, couldn't see where it ended up. The rebound sat there. Mateko able to bank that one from behind the goal line off of Fleming and in. Eric Mateko parked in front of the net. The captain, as they say, wouldn't quit, and he somehow threaded the needle, putting it back, as you say, Joe, in through Fleming's pads and then as Fleming still didn't know where the puck was he ends up works it free and then up the boards it comes Perron cross ice the shot off the side of the net St. Owens back oh. Will Reynolds his pass in deep no icing on the play Tivy to Shank Shank rolls off his stick still in there they score and this hockey game is tied well, and off the turnover, it was just such a quick pull and fire by Pilgrim Edwards. That was below the hash marks, so the reaction time for Gravel nearly impossible as he snapped that one five hole. So the Sea Dog lead Amiot on to Bilodo. Knock to center. We've got a two on one coming. It's in comes Beveridge walking. Beveridge scores! Eager. More than capable to find. That space on Fleming. Yes, indeed. Definitely he wanted to make that pass to Yared going to the front of the net, but the defenseman had laid the body down. But Beveridge goes, well, let's have a go at that top corner. What a shot. 10.50 remains in the second period. Sea Dogs up. Two. Pass is picked off by Bilodeau at center. Tries to go to pedal. It's off his body. And then back. Here comes Maverick, the shot, they score! Marmalek, Maddox, Marmalek. Two on one that started at the blue line and wonder if Gravel was respecting the pass a bit too much as Marmalek snapped that one short side. I think Gravel may have wanted to have that one back. Uh-oh. There's a meeting of the minds over at the bench. Breaks up the play, but keeping it in, Lollier, high slot, Lollier looking, couple toe drags, Garrett all over him, to the point, the shot, and that's into Gravel's equipment, and he will hold with in. six minutes. Gravel leaves it, waits, around the boards it comes, kept in at the line by Clements, and he comes down the wall, into the corner, fed out in front, back door, they score! Maverick Brunet. Well, just not able to get the puck out at the blue line. And then the pass uh, to Gauguin really froze Gravel and the rest of the St. John Sea Dogs. So that little dish from the slot over to Brunet, he had the wide open net. Yeah, there were certainly options in front of the Sea Dog goal. 11.55 remains in this third. Tivy pulled to the ice and then out to center ice. Here comes Huggin. He's in over the line. Huggin. Passes it through, the save by Gravel. Lead pass, here comes Miller. Miller will get to it first, he's got McLean coming. 
McLean in front. Oh, that's he comes up the boards. He's checked along the wall. Then it's out to center ice. Huggin, two on one. In over the line. Huggin, out in front. Coulomb scores. That's Colby Huggin. Doesn't get through. Into the corner. Now, along the boards. Cross tries to work it free. It bounces on him. Cross behind the net. Back up the beverage. Tivy. Pedal shot. That one is out the other side. Knocked down by Beveridge. Saucered back to Tivy. In the pedal. That puck rolls to the front of the net. Bounces around and Fleming wears it. They score! Zach Morin with 40. Too late to get back in, although it's no re-entry. But just a, a bouncing puck everywhere. And Fleming thought he had it. And it was sitting behind him. Morin jotting on the spot. Well, how many times we've seen the Sea Dogs put the puck into the front of the net, and there it sat, just the overhead camera. We just saw it. As you say, Joe, Fleming thought he had it. And move in as a right shot. He's going to try and shoot it. And that is the hockey game. And the Sea Dogs. Go down to defeat here at home ice. So back.